Eason and Colliery Club has marked the 20th anniversary of the pit closure on the day of Margaret Thatcher's funeral. Although by pure coincidence, many took the opportunity to celebrate the death of Margaret Thatcher. Anti-Thatcher banners were proudly displayed as members of Durham Miners Association gathered in the club's car park. People here in Eason believed that Margaret Thatcher was the reason that the community was torn apart after the closure of the pit. Dave Hopkins gave us his thoughts on what impact he thought Margaret Thatcher had on the community. I've got no sympathy for her whatsoever because they killed, they killed the communities when they shut the pits. You know what I mean? So uh, I'll sleep better tonight. In fact, I'm going to buy some drink now. This is all that is left of what was once a thriving mining community. The mine was completely shut down in 1993, but the demise had started during Thatcher's privatisation of the coal industry. The miners' houses are now run down and serve as a constant reminder of the past. The old school is now derelict and unused, and there is a feeling in Easington that they are the town that time forgot. 1,400 jobs were lost in Easington, and the colliery is now the fourth most economically deprived area in England. The media were soon ushered away from the colliery club, so celebrations of the death of Thatcher could commence. The impact of the pit closure is still being felt here in Easington, and only time will tell whether this region can ever recover. Nathan Lee, reporting for Teesside.